Hello everyone, Jim here for Techful Tuts. <coughs> Alright, so today we'll look at uh, how to restrict the access to a folder on your website uh, with uh, HT access and HT password files. So I have here a pretty simple example. Uh, I'll go here, slash admin. And you see here, I have a little box that appears, the username and password. If I put whatever, no, that right one, it doesn't allow me to go to. So if I put the uh, the correct uh, username and password, okay, and bam, I'm here there. Great. So um, we have our basic uh, HTML index.html file. So this you saw and we have here two file HD access and HD password so I'll just delete those and let's get on to our <coughs> HD access and HD password file creating creation so I have the index here and we want to go and create a new file and we're automatically going to save it save as here we go and just save it into your server so I'm using here my dull server and now the first thing you want you, you'll think of doing just saying here okay a dot htx needs to be HD access. well you can't do that because you have here a dot in front so we'll allow you to do this so you just put in within quotes and it should work and here we go. So in our HT access, we need to set here the first thing. So auth user file, and you have to put the suit path to your HT password file. Dot HT password file. So since here I'm using on the uh, on the machine on the, the computer itself, so I have to put to where it's at. So it's on the C drive, C X M P P H T docs admin .ht password so I just put it right there so uh, xampp um, what's the uh, ht docs admin .ht password like that great now here we'll see the auth name so basically what kind of message will display uh, so when you log in so here Please log in and the auth type, the authentication type, uh, we'll just set it to basic. Right, so the next thing is we'll set here some limit. Limit get post and we'll close it to limit. And here we'll say it require valid dash user and now we're ready to go and save it so just save it and let's go to our admin site and see we have here index HT access great so the next thing is to create a HT password file so we'll save it to just make it all types Put in within quotes dot ht password, and in this file we just set in the all the, the the username, colon and the password. We'll say here one two three four. We'll have root four three two two one. We have here Jeremy Techful does. And so now we can use all those username and password to actually get into the admin. And that's how you can restrict it. So if we go back here, go back to local host admin. Oh, shoot. Uh, I have to close it. And redo it. <coughs> and now if we go back to our local host admin. Let's put the username, so say awesome dumb one. Say so, okay, it doesn't work. And you see here we have our auth name, so here please log in right there. So 
it's in here and we'll say the admin can go one two three four and okay and bam you go to the site now if you ever want to ex access those things you no know, people may know oh if they're using HT password you just type in here HT password bam access forbidden so it's a good way to go with that and uh, if we look at the source, just as the source for this page and nothing else. So this is how you can restrict access to a folder, for example, admin pages or a uh, website where you want, just want some part to be uh, to be restricted. Instead of doing some uh, extensive PHP scripting, you can just use that. But you know, PHP might actually go a little better to fit into the, uh, the theme and skin of your site. Well, this could actually just go uh, you know, for just some admin site or whatever. Alright, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.